everyone welcome to budget with nessa um so today we're gonna be cash stuffing all of my envelopes all of my sinking funds and then in the next video i'll be cash stuffing all of my savings so let's get started so today we're gonna be cash stuffing 565 dollars so let's count it one 52, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 500, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65. So 565. So as you know, I just recently started um, budgeting this way. It's been a little over a month and I just felt like it was helping me so much to be able to save um, so much more than like I have been able to save in a really long time. Um, and you know, some people may understand that as a single mother, it can get tight sometimes. So for me doing this way has just been such a game changer for me. Okay, so let's start with the first binder. First, we're just gonna go through my binder. We're gonna take out any excess money and excess change that I did not use throughout the week. So groceries is empty. Gas still has money in it. It's 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, $25. And then it has some change. So I'm just gonna dump this in my little change, I don't know, bucket, container. I don't know what we wanna call that. So I'm gonna take out all the change and just dump it on it. Oh, I missed a penny. Okay. Fast food is empty. Xander, I keep what's in there in their household. I haven't used anything in household, so it still has 15. Beauty, I keep what's in there. Miscellaneous spending. have to um, use my credit card for something um, so I'm going to take the $17 out and I'm going to put this to the side so that we can um, put it in the Amex credit card to pay the bill. So $22 is what's left over from this money. So I also have to get the change type of mom that will have money for myself set aside and I don't really spend it on much because I have a hard time spending money on myself. So that's something that I'm definitely trying to learn more. Okay, so first, I'm not sure what we're going to use this money for, so I'm just going to keep it here for now. Okay, so I'm going to put $60 in groceries. Gas I always put 45 in. That's usually enough for me to be able to. Um, I usually don't want my gas tank go uh, less than half anymore. So 45 is enough money for me to be able to fill up um, twice when it's at half. So 20, 45. Okay, fast food is going to get. $25. And we 
do eat out at least once a week. Xander will be getting $20. As you guys know, Xander is my puppy. He's a little over one years old, but he's about to be a year and a month old. So Xander has 20, 40, 60, 70. And he is getting groomed on Monday, so all of this will be gone by the next time I talk to you guys. Um, household is getting $10. I usually don't really use household as much, that's why I don't stuff a lot in there. Next up is beauty. Beauty is getting $10. actually the nail base that I brought my daughter to because I know last video I said that I was going to have her, her um, acrylic nail taken off and I did so we're going to keep going to that place so that she can continue to get her nails done there because she definitely likes getting her nails done. So 10, 15, 16, 17, 18 dollars is But I also did tell her that you know she gets an allowance so she needs to start using her own money for certain I'll pay for a little bit of it, but like she needs to be able to save her money for the things that she wants so that she can be able to use it for that. So miscellaneous spending will get $20. Mm -hmm. The trainer is going to get $25. Um, it's the dog trainer. Um, she comes once a week. It's more than $25, but this is what I'm suffering for right now. And then I will be getting my normal $25. I always give myself $25. I should probably give myself more because I do work really hard and I deserve it. But $25 is all I get. Next is my broke best friend's allowance. This is a coupon for a free cone at like a ice cream place near us. Um, so she always gets $10 a week. Um, she can lose a dollar for certain things that she doesn't like do without me like asking her to do. And so recently I had asked her to clean out my car and I told her that I would pay her $15. So she's getting $10 plus the $15 that I promised her. So she has a total of $25. And believe me, this will be gone pretty quick because my daughter is a work in progress when it comes to saving money. 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. She's definitely a work in progress. <laughs> The minute that money hits her hand, she's ready to spend it. Or if she like, sometimes she'll ask me to hold her money so that she doesn't spend it. And that's the only way that she's like being good with saving it. So she's a work in progress, my little broke best friend. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna put $25 in her savings. One, two, three, four, five. So here's the $25. 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 
201. So we are getting there slowly but surely. I am saving for her. So dance gets $20. And her dance payment is coming up. And I'm close to what I need, but not fully there. So she has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. Because that automatically comes out of my account. Um, car maintenance, I didn't put any money in, but we will count it. 20, 30, 35, 40 dollars in car maintenance. Um, I didn't stuff it this week. So actually, I will take from this and I will put, uh, let's see, it has 40. I'm gonna need an oil change soon. So I'm gonna take this 20 and put it in car maintenance. Now we have 20, 40, 50, 55, 60. I honestly don't know how much an oil change is because when I got my car, I literally, um, the first one was free. So I'm gonna have to find out how much that is. And then the $17 that I have put aside from um, miscellaneous spending, that is what this $17 is gonna go to towards Amex. So we're gonna take out all the money from Amex and add this $17 in. So we have 150, 250, 350, 70, 80, 90, 400, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So $510. And this I'm going to have to put in my account in um, a few days because it's going to be due. So I made these new ones. Um, clothes is one that I made. I'm not going to be cash stuffing it this time. Um, vacation is another one that I made not putting anything in here either. Retirement, I'm going to cash stuff on the next video. And Black Friday, which we know that this is used for um, Christmas and not Black Friday. And that's gonna be um, stuffed in the next video. Um, $50 and $20 is gonna go to my daughter's PT. So I'm gonna put that aside. Um, she grew really fast, so her um, the like her knee has been like really swollen, so we had to, you know, get her checked out, and um, she's doing fine. And then ten dollars goes towards um, Halloween. I did not make that envelope, so I'm just gonna take this envelope. And put the ten dollars in here and then this money is going to be used for halloween my daughter hasn't decided her costume yet but as soon as she does i'm sure it will not be cheap okay so we still have fifty dollars left and i'm trying to think as to what that's supposed to go to amex i never put the extra money in amex the from the bank in, in there so let me go all the way to Amex. Okay. So we had put the $17 in there that I had spent yesterday from miscellaneous, but I forgot to put in the $50. So Amex really has 150, 250, 350, 400, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 
4, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. So 4, 60. I counted that wrong the first time. Okay. We are all finished. So I think what I'm gonna do with this extra 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, I think I'm either gonna put it towards my 100 envelope challenge or I'm gonna put it towards um, Black Friday or maybe both. So stay tuned for the next episode when I do the 100 envelope challenge um, and the Black Friday cash stuffing. So when I do that video, I am going to be stuffing a lot of envelopes because I, as I said, I've been doing this for about a little over a month, maybe a month and two weeks, maybe a month and three weeks. Um, so you're obviously going to see a lot of envelopes because I want you to see what my progress has been so far. So I'm going to be cash stuffing all of those envelopes. And then I'm also going to be showing you um, all of the ones that I have done for Black Friday. So thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. It would mean the world to me if I can get some subscribers. Um, and so I'll see you in the next one. Bye.